What's up everybody, Dylan aka Druxy here, bringing you Mod Spotlight number 2. This one's going to be for How to Craft Demo. Enjoy. Alrighty, so being this is actually a mod, you do need to go download this. Whatever way you want to do it, I do recommend NexusMods.com. I have a guide in my YouTube channel explaining exactly how to download it, how to get them all working, so on and so forth. So check that out if you haven't already. And so what you want to do is go to Files, Download with Manager, and then you'll see it pops up in your Nexus Mod Manager right here. So in addition to having that mod, you're going to need your local leader perk set to rank 2. It's in your Charisma Tree, so make sure you've got that leveled up. The reason why you need it is so you can actually build your Chemistry Station. The Chemistry Station is where we're going to be crafting all our ammo. So now that you've got the Chemistry Station set up, you can see here under Utility, you have all your ammo. Now, depending on the specific ammo you're trying to craft, they all have specific requirements. Whether that be crafting materials or specific perks that you're going to need in order to actually get that ammo. In the Nexus Mod Manager itself, you can actually set the crafting defaults higher. I have it set to the normal one, which is 25 bits of ammo per craft. However, it can be 10, even 100 or 200. Now just to quickly recap, if you don't have Nexus Mod Manager or you don't know how to install or implement mods to Fallout 4, I strongly recommend you go check out some of my guides. This will be detailing exactly how to get the mods up and running, what you need to change in your files, as well as where to get Nexus Mod Manager and how to go through the installation process. So if you got to the end of the video here, make sure you like, comment and subscribe if you enjoyed. If you got to the end of the video but you didn't enjoy it, then I don't know, leave?